Living life in the front row, to me, is just taking every opportunity and chance to do things that you really want to do. To me, it means being engaged. I think that if you are not active in your choices and not active in uh, your, your presence, it's a problem because then you're, you're just watching it. And why shouldn't you be the participant? We have choices to make all the time. If I'm here, I want to participate. I don't want to waste a minute of it. I want to take in everything and I want to be part of everything. Living life to the fullest, it's just, I really feel just embracing every day. A leader to me is anybody who's willing to step up and make a difference and to really seek to improve themselves and improve all the other people and bring those people with them. That is, I think, ultimately what a leader is. Being a student leader opens up a lot of doors. You not only get to learn about different people, but you also get to learn a lot of things about yourself. Sometimes what I've learned now is that some people need to be in the front and then I will take a step back. Being a student leader has influenced my academic life. I'm very ambitious. I always strive for the best that I can be, whether it be a good grade or just a good project that I do. Uh, I really just try and learn the most that I can from it because it's not always going to be about the grade that you get at the end of the semester, but it's what you learn along the way and the connections that you make as well. If we're going to progress as a society or even as a community, you have to form connections. And I think that without those connections, then you, you will be that island and you will be isolated and left out. You know, you become resources for each other, which is hugely important. You know, once you, you hang out with um, motivated people, you actually get very motivated yourself. It's not always about what you know, it's who you know. And even better, it's whether they know you. We have something uh, really shiny and valuable and that sometimes the life muddies us up, but we really want to find each other and be happy and be complete again and not fragments. So I think forming connections is crucial. But it's those subtle personal connections that I think can really be very influential and important in, in determining where you end up in life. The only thing you can control sometimes in your life is how committed you are to a goal. You can't control necessarily what other people will say or do, but you do have control over yourself and your decision. Commitment is so important because if you want to make that goal happen, you want to make a change, you have to be committed, you have to be persistent, and you have to add a little bit to it each day. So the thing is, if you want something and you don't give up, and you put your mind to it, it's going to work. Sometimes you have to do things that aren't exactly comfortable for you. And you have to do these uncomfortable things before you can do things that make you happy. Nobody likes change. Everybody hates change. But change is good. Change is really good because it gives you uh, new opportunities. You know, they say one door closes, another door opens. The changes that I wanted to make um, from high school to college was to be more myself and to really figure out who I am. With my students especially, as soon as they walk in my door, I'll say to them, you have a mission. And your mission is to change the world. It doesn't really matter where you make that impact as long as you do it. You know, if you impact, um, if you impact one person in your life, that means you've impacted one person in your life, and that's a difference. You should contribute. That's what everything's all about. It's not just about self-serving. It's about contributing to the greater good. We are not uh, separate in our lives. I think we're all connected in one way or another and, and it is our responsibility to support each other. It's beyond college, it's just in life in general. I encourage students to strive to be the best that they can be. Try to be because if someone else can do it then why can't you? Say hi to the person next to you. It definitely makes you feel better. It makes people more excited to come to class. Think big and start small. Go explore. You know, there's so much to explore. Get out there, participate. Don't be afraid, live your life. Don't be an observer. Get out there and live it, and live your life in the front row.